when we look at this cable chart, it's best to look at this weekly chart to show the medium to longer term picture right now. That's because the market has seen a big decline in 2018, but that decline is starting to find some support at a very important level. That support comes in by a previous resistance post the 2016 E referendum, which is now seen as a major support, a previous resistance turned support ahead of what could be a resumption of gains that takes this market all the way back up towards and through the 2018 high, that post E referendum high from April of this year that came in just under 144. But for this recovery and potential longer term bullish shift to continue to be a possibility, the market's going to need to continue to push higher. The next key level of resistance comes in from a high looking at this daily chart on a short term basis at 132.15. That's a high from mid July. A break above there will continue to strengthen this case for a longer term shift in the structure for cable. As far as setbacks go right now, any setbacks should be ideally now well supported into dips towards that recent low that we had seen, which came in at right around 127.85.